The Adelgan Pedestal Mounted Air Defense System, PMAD, is a self-propelled, short-range air defense system developed by the Turkish defense industry to protect ground units from aerial threats such as cruise missiles, unmanned aerial vehicles, low-flying fixed-wing aircraft, and helicopters. Developed primarily for the Turkish Armed Forces, it has been integrated into both the Turkish Land Forces and the Turkish Naval Forces, demonstrating its versatility in different operational environments. The Adelgan system was developed over a period of 12 years, beginning with conceptual design and feasibility studies in 1989. After extensive testing and trials, the system entered serial production in 2001 through a collaboration between Aselsan and Roketsan. The system proved its capabilities through rigorous field trials, and its success was underscored when it outperformed competing German systems in a 2005 tender, leading to interest from foreign buyers, including the Dutch Army. Production remains ongoing, with over 100 units currently in service with the Turkish Land Forces. Mounted on a modified heavy-armored M113A2 tracked vehicle, the Itilgan PMAD is equipped with a turret housing two Stinger missile launcher pods, each capable of firing up to four infrared ultraviolet guided missiles. The system operates with a three-man crew consisting of a driver, a gunner, and a commander, designed to provide low-level air defense for mobile and stationary troops, convoys, and tactical bases. Atelgan offers high-hit capability and short reaction time. Its advanced fire control computer, two-axis stabilized turret, and integrated target search and tracking sensors ensure precise targeting even while on the move. Additionally, it is equipped with a 12.7 millimeter automatic machine gun for self-protection and engagement of near-air threats. It incorporates passive target detection systems, including thermal and daylight TV cameras, and features an identification friend or foe system to distinguish between friendly and enemy targets. Furthermore, its modular design allows for integration onto different carrier platforms, enhancing its adaptability in modern warfare. The Atelgan PMAD has seen extensive deployment within the Turkish Armed Forces, particularly in areas where mobile air defense capabilities are critical. It has been used to safeguard military convoys, forward operating bases, and strategic assets, ensuring a robust protective layer against aerial threats. The system has been deployed in various regions where Turkey faces security challenges, particularly in cross-border operations in Syria and Iraq where UAV and low-altitude air threats have become increasingly common. During Turkey's military interventions in Syria, the Atilgan played a crucial role in protecting ground units from drone and low-flying aircraft attacks. With the increasing use of drones in modern warfare, particularly by insurgent groups and non-state actors, the system has provided a necessary countermeasure to mitigate these threats. The ability to operate in rugged terrain and provide air defense support in fast-changing battle conditions has made Adelgan a key component of Turkey's force projection in the region. Furthermore, the system has been integrated into Turkey's naval air defense strategy. While primarily designed for land-based operations, naval adaptations have allowed its deployment on military vessels providing an additional layer of air defense for naval task forces. This integration enhances Turkey's ability to secure maritime operations, particularly in the Aegean and Mediterranean regions, where geopolitical tensions necessitate a strong defense posture. As Turkey continues to develop its indigenous defense capabilities, the Atilgan Piyamad aligns with the country's broader strategy of self-reliance and modernization. The system plays a vital role in the nation's layered air defense approach, complementing higher altitude and long-range systems such as the Hisar air defense family. The integration of Atilgan within a network defense architecture ensures comprehensive protection against a spectrum of aerial threats from low-altitude UAVs to high-speed fighter jets. In contemporary warfare, air superiority is a decisive factor and Turkey's emphasis on mobile air defense reflects the changing nature of modern battlefields. With adversaries increasingly utilizing drone swarms and precision-guided munitions, 
Having an agile, rapidly deployable defense system like the Adelgan is essential. The system's fire-on-the-move capability and ability to coordinate with command and control networks make it a versatile tool for dynamic operations. Turkey has also sought to enhance its interoperability within NATO and allied military structures, ensuring that the Elgan can be integrated into broader coalition defense frameworks. The system's ability to use the FIM-92 Stinger missile, a widely adopted NATO standard weapon, enhances its compatibility with allied forces. This capability ensures that Elgan equipped units can operate alongside allied air defense assets in joint military exercises and potential combat scenarios. When compared to regional competitors, Adelgan holds its own against similar systems such as the Russian Pantsir S-1, the American Avenger Air Defense System, and the Chinese HQ-17. While the Pantsir S-1 boasts a combination of missiles and autocannons with a longer range, its bulkier design limits its mobility compared to the Adelgan. The Avenger system, mounted on a wheeled Humvee platform, provides a similar missile-based defense but lacks the Atilgan's armored protection and off-road mobility. The Chinese HQ-17, on the other hand, offers an advanced radar-guided missile capability but is primarily geared towards more traditional, static air defense roles. One of Atilgan's key advantages is its combination of mobility and versatility. Unlike static or heavily armored air defense platforms, it can rapidly redeploy to protect advancing troops, making it ideal for Turkey's operational needs. Additionally, its use of passive tracking sensors provides resilience against electronic warfare tactics, an increasing concern in modern conflicts where adversaries may attempt to jam or spoof radar-based systems. As military technology continues to evolve, Turkey is likely to introduce upgrades to the Atilgan system to maintain its relevance on the battlefield. Future enhancements may include improved sensor packages, integration with artificial intelligence for target recognition, and the development of indigenous missile systems to replace the Stinger, ensuring long-term independence from foreign suppliers. Turkey's defense industry spearheaded by companies like Aselsan and Roketsan, has demonstrated a strong commitment to continuous improvement. Potential future variants of the Adelgan could feature integration with Turkey's drone and unmanned combat aerial vehicle networks, allowing for a more cohesive and responsive air defense ecosystem. Additionally, improved electronic warfare countermeasures and extended range missile capabilities could further enhance its effectiveness against modern threats. Overall, Adelgan presents a well-balanced solution that prioritizes mobility, rapid response, and adaptability. Its integration into Turkey's military strategy underscores the country's commitment to indigenous defense production and self-reliance. As drone warfare and air-based threats continue to evolve, systems like Atelgan will play a crucial role in ensuring Turkey's air defense capabilities remain robust and responsive to emerging challenges. With ongoing advancements and potential exports to allied nations, Atilgan stands as a testament to Turkey's growing defense industry and its ability to produce world-class military solutions.